What's up guys, this is Osas from Samsung Galaxy S3 Soft Modder, and today I'm going to be showing you how to read and reply to messages while you're in a full screen application. So if you're in a full screen application on your S3 and somebody sends you a text message, you'll get a, the LED flash and a noise if your sound is on, but you won't actually get that pop up to see what they wrote which is good and bad. It's good because it doesn't distract you from what you're doing, but it's bad because it could be important. And instead of having to drop this down to read what they said, or drop it down, click on it, and then respond if it's too long for the notifications menu, you can actually download this new app. It's um, called IB Popup. The link to this download is available in the full tutorial, so make sure to check that out. We're gonna hit download. Um, since it's a third-party application, we're going to need to allow for unknown sources. So you go to settings, you go to security, under device administration, and we're going to check this. So that'll allow you to download the, the APK file. Once the APK file is downloaded, you're going to have to choose an installer. Just click just once and you can go with Google or the, the Android one. It doesn't really matter. And it'll, it'll install and then it'll appear on your home screen and it's right here. We're just going to open it up and the first thing you want to do is you're going to want to activate it. So you're going to go tap on this. It'll take you to the accessibility and under services you're going to turn IB pop-up on. Now we're going to go back and we're going to make sure it's turned on here. Tap that and then you're going to follow the, the yellow whatever yellow box and hit activate. You can also check out this short little tutorial of what you can do to respond and, and whatnot. So we're going to hit that. Now it's on and I'm going to send a test message while in a full screen application just so you guys can see exactly what it looks like. So here's Candy Crush. I'm going to send a test message to this phone. Um, it should appear in a couple seconds. You're going to hear the sound because I have my sound on. And so this is what you receive. So from here, you can either close it by pressing the X, obviously, or you can tap on this and you can reply. Like so. Now, sometimes the actual, the, the compose box is hidden behind the text box. So you can't actually see what you're writing, but obviously that didn't happen this time and you're going to hit the, the send button and now it's sent and also sometimes the send button doesn't appear so if you want to alleviate that problem from ever happening you can go back go to the, the app here and then click enter to send so now on your keyboard you can just hit enter and it will send it instead of waiting for the, the send icon to appear now those are just two issues that, that do come up another issue is sometimes the the resizing box, it, depending on your display, this might be super small. And if you go horizontal, I think I have to enable screen rotation. If you flip it horizontally, sometimes it, so you can see how it overlaps and you can't, I mean, it's basically, you can't use it. So those are a couple issues and some other issues are, are listed in the full tutorial. You can see what happens again, how it shrinks down. That's just one of the one of the things you're going to have to deal with, but um, the developer is looking to fix that. And so from here, you can also test the changes that you make. So if you want the SMS size to be bigger or smaller, you can change that here. The Compose window, you can just, and then you can test what that'll look like. So that's what, if somebody sends you a text, that's what it's going to look like. And you just, it'll stay up there for five seconds. And then if you want to revert back to um, the defaults, you can just click clear variables and reset, and that's really it. So, it's um, IB pop-up, it's available, and the XDA forms link, which is provided in the full tutorial. Make sure to check it out, it's super convenient if you're trying to respond to or see um, your SMS notifications while you're in a full screen app, instead of having to click out or drop down the menu. So make sure to check that one out, um, and also make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. 
and make sure to check out the full tutorial on Samsung Galaxy S3 soft monitor for the link and more information. Thanks guys.